Joe Dieter of Blind River asks, why does uh, baking soda absorb the odors in your fridge? Well, Joe, the correct term is adsorb, A-D-S-O-R-B, meaning the odor sticks to the baking soda as opposed to the soaking up action of absorption. Let me show you what I mean. You see, baking soda is a base. The bad smells in your fridge tend to be acidic, uh, vinegar. When you mix them together, they react to produce a neutral, odorless salt. And that's what happens in your fridge. So, uh, uh, why does baking soda wear out? Well, after three or four months, so much salt is produced that it overtakes the baking soda and you have to replace it. Must have been that casserole. <sighs> Sherry Dorsey of Sault Ste. Marie wants to know why our eyes and mouth water when we yawn. Well, perhaps we should start with why we yawn in the first place. The short answer is, we don't know. Now, there's a theory that yawning is triggered by high levels of carbon dioxide in our blood that makes us sleepy. So when we take a deep breath, we increase our blood oxygen levels, and that livens us up. But it's just a theory, and a lot of scientists don't believe it's true. However, we do know why your eyes water. When you yawn, you contort your facial muscles, and that puts pressure on your tear glands, which squeezes out tears and makes your eyes water. Those same contortions also put pressure on your salivary glands, and that makes your mouth water, too. Frank Mariscog of Brighton wants to know why fruits bruise. When a fruit falls from the tree to the ground, or to the floor, the impact causes some of these cells to rupture. This allows the enzymes and other chemicals within the cells to escape. They mix with the acid in the fruit and cause a chemical reaction that turns the fruit brown and mushy. Now, it may be a nuisance to us, but bruising is nature's way of decomposing the fruit. This way, the seeds inside can reach the soil and begin to germinate. Bruising may not look too appealing, but it's still edible. <laughs>